phenomenal lineup, probably the strongest lineup we've ever had, actually. And um, maybe the first time I, I was trying to think whether it was the first time we've ever had two American headliners. I think it might be, um, and and probably uh, well, I mean, the, the suggestion would be the biggest uh, Saturday headliner we've ever had, really, with the Killers. Um, Mumford and Sons phenomenal last year sold out uh, close to the festival killers this year sold out already in terms of the Saturday tickets uh, that's put pressure on the weekend tickets the weekend tickets are selling faster than they normally do as a result of that as well huge change to the food actually I felt possibly that I'd let the food slip a little if I'm being absolutely honest with you and uh, I wanted to do an absolute 100% change and I've done that and um, I brought in Street Feast uh, Street Feast is an organization in London where um, uh, you know the food traders are all they all individually prepare their food and that's the key thing about street food is that it's individually prepared um, it's not um, a frozen burger that uh, you know is, is uh, you know can be sold at any number of stands um, everything is individually prepared and and whether that's taste of Tibet or whether it's dumplings or whether it's um, you know whether it's um, you know fundies um, you know wood fired pizza from Ipswich um, you know the, the the range of food I think I've got over 80 food traders coming and the range will be phenomenal my name is Lucy Wood I'm the music booker for Latitude Festival and I would say top tip wise I really love Solange I think that's going to be a completely mesmerizing captivating show I saw a few years ago and um, and I'm told and it was amazing then and I'm told the live show has come on even more since then so I think that's it is unmissable in my view um, also the killers of course because they are basically the best live performers in the world and then a kind of small personal favorite i really i love the breeders and those are just three and there's like 117 other bands that i love i'm tanya harrison latitude's arts curator and my top picks for this year i think possibly will be some of the shows on the waterfront uh, arena i think um, phoenix dance theatre who are coming to latitude for the first time uh, with windrush um, show also new adventures a previewing swan lake and that's going out in tour in september and also so is sylvia the suffragette movement piece um, from zoo nation so both those are previews so a little bit of a special treat for latitude getting in early i'm sharon rubin and i'm the curator of the kids teen and family activities every area has got something new this year up in the enchanted garden for example Archery, we've never done archery before, can't wait to see that. In the kids area, my big thing, um, Chelsea Physic Garden, really excited about having them coming to talk about everything to do with plants and botanicals and the power of plants. They've never done anything like this before, so I know that's going to be amazing. And then in the teen area, uh, how to create a podcast, um, activities around gaming and, you know, building and creating games and also VR, VR and VR sculpting. Very exciting. I just about understand it.